Hello scholars, in this problem we're going to fill out this form and the form has starting time, ending time, and elapsed time. We just gotta figure out which one is missing and fill it in. So starting from the first problem we have our start time is 5.20 a.m. and our lapse time is 5 hours and 55 minutes. So we're looking for 5 hours and 55 minutes after 5.20 which is just an addition problem, right? 5 hours and 55 minutes, and when we add these two together, we get 75 minutes. Oops, we need to carry an hour. This goes down to 15, and an hour gets carried over here. And 6 plus 5, that equals 11. So the time should be 11.15 a.m. After erasing this, we're going to move on to problem 2. Now problem 2, what do we have? We have the ending time, and we have our lapse time. So if you want to find a starting time, we have to subtract from our end time. So our end time is 4.30, and our lapse time is 2 hours and 35 minutes. Subtraction. Oh, no, we can't do this, right? The minute hand, minute side, we can't do that. We have to borrow an hour. This becomes a 90 because that hour becomes 60 minutes. And this gets me, ooh, 55 minutes. And 3 minus 2 is 1. So it should be 1.55 as our starting time. Check my math. Go back and redo this to see if this is correct. Now, after I erase this, we're going to get on with problem number three. With problem number three, we can go ahead and use our original formula, final time, which is 9.05, minus the initial time, which is 5.25. And we have to borrow another hour. and we get 40 minutes and 3 hours. So our elapsed time was 3 hours and 40 minutes. Now, this very last problem, oops, left something on here. Very last problem, we have our ending time and we have our elapsed time. Our ending time is midnight. So, 4 hours before midnight, I'm trying to think about when that would be. That would be weird. It's going to be AM or is it going to be PM? Huh. I think there might be something wrong with this problem. I think this might be PM. I think four hours and five minutes should be in the middle of the night. So, but let's let's try this. Let's go from 12 AM and let's subtract four hours and five minutes from it. What do we get? Well, I have to borrow another hour and we get 55, 11 minus 4 is 7. Hmm. Midnight, 4 hours and 5 minutes before that, should be 7.55 p.m. So this should actually be 7.55 p.m.